Hey man, say man, hey. Ah, wait a minute, man, wait a minute. Uh, what it do, gang? Your boy CJ on 32. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, that ain't it either, man. That ain't it. Uh, 44 gang, what's happening, man? Your boy, hear me like. No, no, no. It ain't it, man. What it is, you too, man? It's your boy, Big T Ward, man. Y'all see his name in the bottom of the screen, man. I'm back at y'all. For another video, man. Y'all see your boy inside the cockpit of the Charger, man. Um, so today, man, y'all saw the title, the thumbnail, man. Before I get to the video, like, share, subscribe, man. Comment, follow your boy, fuck with your boy, man. Also, before I get started, y'all know your boy having his first pull up in park, man. March 21st, it's going to be at um, Big Daddy Pawn Shop, man. From Memphis, from the Memphis area, man, y'all already know what it is. You know where it's at. Uh, for those people that's coming. From somewhere else out of town, man. It's 3700 Hickory Hill Road, man, in Memphis. Um, can't miss it, man. Big Daddy Pond. Big Daddy Pond Shop, man. Parking lot is huge. Uh, it's a nice spot to, you know, do your burnouts, man. Do all that slide, all that good stuff, man. So we're going to have a good turnout, man. Hopefully, hopefully, we have a good turnout, man. And also, bring everybody out, man. Bring your family, bring your friends, your kids, man. It's going to be a nice little event, man. Of course, my street around the fam will be out, man, along with my boy AJ, my boy Ace, hang with Ace Boogie. Make sure you give him a follow, man. Uh, but um, it's going to be $10 to get in, man. $10 to get in, park your car on the lot, do your thing, man. And that's to, you know, you don't want the police coming out and and making you leave and all that good stuff, man. So make sure you come out March 21st, man, and kick it with your boy, man. Fuck with your boy. Your local YouTube, man. Your boy, Big T Boy, man. Y'all see another one back there, man. Big T Ward, y'all see it on the windshield, bro. Come on, man. Go hit that subscribe button, man. Gonna do that. Y'all seen the title, thumbnail, man. I got the Nitro, man. OBD2 performance chip, man. Um, so I ordered this, man. I seen like a, a video or two of people getting performance chips. Um, I'm just trying it out, man. Like I said, I haven't tune the car or anything like that so I don't know if it'll do any difference or you can tell any difference um by you know installing this little chip man um but I know my boy AJ has one on his ride man and he said you know he saw a little difference um but you know keep in mind he got it he has a 392 uh he's tuned he's all that good stuff man so um but I'm gonna see man on just not putting anything on the car see how it does and i can see if i tell the difference um in it man so like i say my car is probably it's mostly completely stock man just a little small kodak intake that i'm gonna change y'all know that man um but um i put 392 core packs in so uh got the kodak intake all that stuff's coming soon so <clears throat> excuse me man but i got the chip man so let me let y'all this is a chip, man, right here. Uh, they come in different colors, man. Red, yellow, orange, you know, whatever. And uh, so I'm going to try it out, man, and see what it is. Uh, just came out here, man. Wait till I get home. I came to Walmart, man. Brought my girl out here to Walmart and all that. But uh, I'm going to see what it does, man. And uh, test it out, man. Y'all see it says 35% more power, 25% more torque. I don't know. If it will give you that, man, just from this little chip, you know what I mean? Don't have me, you know, lying to you and say it does or whatever. I'm going to give y'all my honest opinion about the chip. Uh, once I, you know, put it on, man, once I get home, uh, try to do it before I get dark, man. Uh, simple setup. Got the instructions on the back. Uh, so, 
I'm gonna see what it is, man. We're gonna see what it is. Um, at the end of the video, man, I will just, you know, kind of let y'all know, you know, my opinion or whatever, man, or whatever, you know, and let you know where I got it from. Uh, oh, it's off eBay, man. So it wasn't much. Uh, they got some that's forty. That's got some that's fifty. 60 bucks some of them 80 bucks you know what I'm saying pretty much the same chip just different prices from different sellers so this one right here man was like 30 bucks or so something like that wasn't much man so that's why i say what are you going to get 35 percent more horsepower or 25 percent more torque i don't know you know what i mean uh but we're going to see uh we're going to see what it is man we're going to test it out um as y'all know these cars come with 370 or 375 horsepower uh, they up the horsepower like every other year on these cars on the rts and stuff like that man so um i know some of the older models was like 360 then they went up to 365 then they went to 370 you know what I'm saying or whatever so um but i will let y'all see um you know what this thing would do man i'm gonna do a couple pulls in it hopefully i can get a couple pulls before um, it get dark and stuff like that, man. So, um, that's what it is, man. That's what this video is about. And we're going to see what it is, man. We're going to see what it is. And hopefully, you know, some good results. If it's bad results, we're still going to put it up, man. But like I say, this is my first time ever getting a little chip or something like that, man. You know, as far as performance-wise for a car, man. Because usually, you know, like I said, I tune my truck at the time so you know we're gonna see what it is man but enough talking man just wanted y'all to see what that was and i'm gonna go through the installing process and all that kind of stuff man once i make it home i can get settled in stuff like that man and let y'all see what it does and i turn the camera back on then man it's your boy bt ward man all right youtube man got this thing plugged up man uh they said plug it up first and uh, I think gotta plug it up, man, and turn the ignition on. So we're gonna turn it on, man, and uh, have it on for a minute, like a couple seconds. It says. Uh, so I think it turned it on. Let it stay on for a few seconds, man, and. Uh, I actually just turn it off, I think. At about five seconds, it's been about five seconds, so we turn it off. And, uh, and after that, man, it's just say start the engine. We'll wait. Uh, so after releasing the button, man, wait for a while, like 30. 50 some seconds man so let it wait for a while let it sit for a minute man and then start the engine and um kind of go from there man so um quickly man i'm gonna try to hit the performance pages up man and um hopefully my screen don't blank up probably blank out once i open the door i'm gonna let the uh performance pages load up and uh, I went off. <laughs> I went off, man. So I ain't gonna try to do it yet. I'm gonna wait until it's about, you know, wait till a little time pass, man. And crank the car, see what's up. Uh, as I said before, man, this junk is, is like 375 horsepower stock, man. Uh, when I put it in the core packs, and I think it went up like 389 as far as horsepower uh, and we're gonna see what it does man we're gonna see if this thing gonna make any difference like i said though you know man um you get what you pay for so this is just a little small mod man something that i saw that i'll give it a try you know what i mean it's nothing that that's all written in stone like it's gonna give you all this you know crazy horsepower man so like i say i'm just trying to do some look you know do some experimenting and see what's up, see what's what. Like I said, my boy had one, man. AJ got one. And um, he said it worked fine, man. It, you know, did pretty good on his car. 
Um, he also had an RT2, which he gave to his his girlfriend, man. So he put it back on there, and he said, did it make a little difference? Um, you know, on his car, on that car, whatever. And uh, so I think he originally got it for the five seven. Um, they got some for like, you know, the six four stuff like that, man. So they got stuff for different things. So you know, go see what it is, man, and you know, and go from there. Uh, like I said, man, it been about 30, 40 seconds or whatever, man. Wait a couple more seconds, then I'm started up. And just kind of go from there, man. And he said, just, you know, start the engine, man, and, you know, let it do, man. Let it go, you know. It's supposed to uh, have, like, uh, you know, as far as gas mileage and all that kind of stuff, man. It's supposed to do a little something different to that, man. So we're going to see. We're going to see what it is, man. So let me start this thing up, man. It's been a little while, so. So we're going to see what it is. We're going to see how it does. So far, man, no check engine lights or nothing like that on. So uh, now we good. Performance pages, man. That's what's up? Man, what we got going on here? Right, everything normal. There we go. Performance pages. So, we're gonna see what it is, man. Probably better to tell. Once I get on down the road or something like that, man, we're gonna see uh, what it does. So, you know, we're gonna see what it does, man. We're gonna see what it does. Like I say, ain't no check engine light or nothing like that on, man. And we're just seeing what it is. Let this performance page load up and go from there, man. And see what, see what we're looking at. Uh, as far as horsepower and stuff like that, man. As you know, these things come with little dinos and stuff like that, man, that you can uh, see what you have, man, as far as torque and power, you know, and stuff like that. So, yeah, we're going to see what it is, though. No. Uh, yeah, we're going to see what it is, man. Just sitting there idle right now. So I hit it. You know. We're gonna see what's what, man. So we're gonna see what it is. As I just went on, decided to go and do the little video right here, man, because my girl taking, you know, she's doing a little business up in the um in Walmart. So try to get this video in, man, before it get dark, stuff like that, man. It's, as far as you know plugging it in getting everything done and see what's what so we're gonna see what it is man uh like i said it wasn't no change or anything like that man we're gonna see you know what the horsepower is and all that good all that good jazz man so we're gonna see what it is we're gonna see what it is man but uh i'm gonna turn the camera back on man once i get rolling and get out of here and all that man i'll turn the camera back on and see uh let y'all see the difference you know what i'm saying or let y'all see uh, my reaction to it man or whatever once we get ready to pull out and leave see what it do man we'll see what it does but it's your boy big t boy man i'll turn the camera back on in a minute man what it is youtube man your boy back man your boy back so man i got the chip installed man before i get into the video like subscribe comment Follow your boy, man. Y'all see the name at the bottom of the screen. Uh, I got this thing hooked up, man. And as a matter of fact, I'm gonna give y'all a good little run, good little pull in it, man. Uh, like I said, I was giving my review on it. So, this is gonna be my take on it, man. 
this thing started. And this is going to be my take on it, man. Now, as far as um, gas mileage and, you know, stuff like that, um, I'm going to have to wait till I get on, like, an open road, open highway, man, and all that, and then go from there. Don't forget, man, March 21st, man. I'll let your boy, man. We're going to be at Big Daddy Pawn Shop, man. March 21st, 3700 Hickory Hill Road, man, in Memphis. $10 to get in, man. Come in, bring the family, all that, man. So come show out. Bring the cars out, man. Bring the family out. Bring the whips out, man. Trucks, cars, bikes, whatever, man. Come on out. Hang with your boy, man. Big T Ward, man. On the road to 10K, baby. On the road to 10K, man. So, hey, thanks to everybody, man, that's supporting the channel. Everybody that's supporting your boy, man. Following your boy. Um, I read all the comments, man. Uh, somebody left me a comment on one of my older videos, man, when I first got the charger. You know, I think the guy, I think they, uh, like their last name of McAllister's, something like that. And they just got the uh, the 21 charger, man, RT Blacktop. Uh, the same one I got, man. I got the Blacktop uh, edition also. Uh, so, congrats to them, man. Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate the, the the love, man. Appreciate the support. Thanks for watching the channel, man. And I'm gonna keep trying to bring some some entertainment, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm checking, try to keep bringing it, keep bringing it, man. Also, man, go check out Hang with H Boogie, man. Check out him, his wife, man. He just put up a video, man. Check out his wife' car, man. Nice ride, dope ride, man. Uh, he just finished that up. I think he's gonna work on his neck. So go over there, man. Hang with H Boogie, man. Go give him a follow, man. Uh, a lot of other buddies, man, that I got uh, hanging. Uh, Golden Jewel, man. Go check him out. Uh, Pikachu, go check him out, man. Uh, them guys about to collab again, I think. And uh, funny video the first time, man. So them guys, you know, they doing their thing, man. They doing their thing. Uh, um, other than that, man. Other than that. And we're going to get some, some pulls in this thing, man. Let y'all see what it is man so um uh, i'm not gonna mount it up uh, i'm gonna be talking man and whatever you know flipping back and forth so i ain't want to just mount man, and then just have it up here so uh, i want y'all to see what i'm seeing and all of that man so let me put the seat belt on get that cracking first uh I'll let y'all know what it is man but this is the uh continuance man of the Nitro man, OBD2 performance chip man. I mean, hey, uh, after driving it today, man, hey, hey, this, you know, I'm uh, I drove it this morning, man, and and now back in it this evening, so uh, just coming home in it, man. Like I said, I'm not in the sport mode or anything like that. Uh, so I'll give me a second, man, let me buckle up. All right, man, I'm all strapped in, so let y'all know, man, get this pool. No sport mode, man. Just regular. Y'all get the exhaust, man. I mean, this thing, man, good pool, bro. Good pools, man. Hey, this 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 chip, uh, you know, it says it gives you, like, 25% more power and 35% more torque. You know, like I said, I don't know how true that is, man. Uh, I haven't had anything dynoed or anything like that, so I won't know, uh, you know, if that's possible. I, I wouldn't have no clue about none of that. Um, so I couldn't tell you if it was dynoed or anything. Uh, um, I mean, not far as dyno, but I don't know if it's uh, give you that kind of power, to put it that way. Uh, like I said, I haven't had it dynoed or anything like that. But I installed the chip yesterday, man. It was getting kind of dark, getting kind of dark like it is now. And uh, like I say, man, I work. So, but I'm trying to bring y'all some some good entertaining videos, man. Trying to bring something different, get people to fall in love, back in love with the five sevens, man. You know, I know we all get scat packs. I'm gonna get one too in a few months, to be honest. Uh, and so I'm gonna start building that, man. Be basically doing both cars, man. So it's gonna be, you know, something I'm gonna be doing the whole the whole time. So. Um, you know, but I'm basically getting people, I'm um, trying to get people, you know, fall back in love with the five sevens, man. You know, before that, 
you know, it was SRT8s and it was just RTs and SRT8s, man. It wasn't no Hellcats, wasn't no Red Eyes, wasn't no Demons, you know what I'm saying? It was, you know, Daytona and it was, the, you know, it was the RT and it was the SRT8s. And, you know, that's pretty much what it was. It wasn't nothing else. And um, so now, you know, trying to get people to fall in love, back in love with the 5.7, man. So just trying to get a couple pulls in this thing, man. I'm going to do a lot of talking and all that, man. Just showing y'all, you know, or explaining, really. And letting, just letting y'all see, man. And uh, But y'all see, man, the thing was not in sport mode. So I'm definitely in sport mode. So let y'all see, man, what it is in sport mode. to the pedal like i said i already got the race pedal on here but you know as far as it, it shifting and all that it shifts a lot smoother it shifts a lot better um so it's definitely it's definitely doing that man can't argue with that can't argue with that man but i wanted to let y'all see man uh me in sport mode and just regular mode man pulling in this thing uh just a little quick video man it's about to get dark so i know it won't be able to uh to show everything man but i want to get this little video out man about this um this nitro uh obd2 man performance chip uh my boy aj told me about that and he got it on his uh five seven well, he got it on his uh he had it on his challenger and uh he put it on his uh he actually put it on his on his scat pack but he said he could tell the difference maybe because he's already tuned and you know you can't just really feel that little bit you know, but like I say, man, that thing was probably like 30 bucks. Um, you know, I'm definitely gonna put a picture up and, you know, there's no link. I, like I said, I got it off eBay. Um, and basically you just go on eBay and just type it in and it's gonna come up, man. So there's no link to it where you can go, you know, and, you know, hit the link and all that kind of stuff, man. It's just, I found it on eBay, man, just searching. And, you know, just, I just typed in performance chips and, you know, a list of them popped up, man. So they all different prices. Um, you know, it depends on who's selling, who's selling it, man. Like they got different sellers and stuff on eBay. So it depends on who's selling and where, you know, you know, where they are and all that kind of stuff. And it's, it's different prices, man. But, you know, for, for the money, you know, and get the little, you know, the little boost, you know, that it gives, you know, it's all right. You know, that's my take on it. It's all right, man. You know what I mean? It's nothing to be like, oh, this shit just, nah, you know, none of that, you know. So I am not exaggerating, man. No. Uh, but it, it does give you a little bit, man. You know. You know. It give you a little, you know. You know, but, you know, for boy like me, man, I'm just testing out something. This is nothing. Ultimately, this is my first time ever buying any kind of performance chip, you know, for a vehicle. So, you know, just something I'm trying, man. So. I right, hope y'all enjoyed the video, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video, bro. And uh, make sure you hit that like button, man. Make sure you hit the share button. You make sure you fuck with your boy, man. Don't forget, come fuck with your boy, man. March twenty first, now. You know, come on out, man. Bring everybody out, man. And uh, and do that, man. So I look forward to seeing everybody, man. Hopefully, we can make this thing a good event, ongoing event. Uh, so we're gonna try it, man. We're gonna see what's up. We're gonna see what it is. We're gonna go from there, man. You know. And but about to run in the store, man. And uh, handle some little business. And I'll catch y'all on the next round, man. But this your boy, Big T Ward, man. I'm out, man.